patience and execution on the offensive end. So, so Turu down low, tried to kiss it in, gets his own miss, goes back up strong and gets fouled. Jump and get back in passing lanes, and that's what Jalen did, did right there, saving a one-on-one -on -one post move. That's a three from McBrayer. Swish. Tipped into the backcourt by Kalsher. Gibbs feeding on Poku, but that's taken away. Here come the Gophers on the move. McBrayer to the rim. Now Nears trying to get on the board, and that's a block. Looked like Oturu is the one that got most of the hands on it. The other way, the stuff. Really kicking into gear a few times on the fast break. Defense to offense, Jordan Murphy, block shot, kicks it ahead. With the right hand, able to scrape and rake the ball free from Jordan Murphy. Line it up at three, D Barnes, got it. 13 on the shot clock is the Mountaineers. Played into Gibbs. Jalen Gibbs, a transfer from Duke, played his first season last year at Drake, I should say. That ball. <laughs> Between an orange cone and a chair on defense. Did this go around you then? Yeah. The effort was there, though. D Barnes, nice play there. Good start for D Barnes. Morris rolls around and in for Fano Morris, a freshman. And a 6-0 run here for the Mountaineers. Ooh. A two-on-two -two for the Mountaineers. Now Malik Jefferson getting in the play. And sure. Great sequence for Naminé with the huge rejection and then the offensive. You're on, you're on alert. Eric Curry. Long pass. Kalsher has that blocked. Opoku with the block. The ball out of bounds. Last touch by Minnesota. They dropped from 345th to 352nd out of the 353 teams. So all freshmen and sophomore. And they, right now they're in a big scoring drop. Opoku again providing good size and dissuasion inside. Sean Quee and one. Isaiah Washington into the game for Minnesota. He's one of their most exciting players with his handles, as we're seeing here. Get to the paint. Jelly fan. Coffee, a little behind the back. Dribble and a jam for Amir Coffee. Good ball movement. A three by Kalsher. T Barnes now leading the mountain, scoring with eight points. Gibbs saved it, but. Right back to Minnesota, a driving lay in there for Kalsher. For Omar Habwe. Here's Washington, decides to pull it up and bank it in. From this handle there on the exchange from Oturu. Seven on the shot clock. Washington, back cut, laid up and in by Michael Hurt and Wood. But they go out and play guys. I mean, Coach Greg Horenda doing a great job at Fairleigh Dickinson. They're the favorites to win the league this year. Fado Morris, three-point shot. I could get up to a quad watch, but then, you know, that's as much as I can watch. You only have two eyes, right? It's Coffee. And the lefty lays it in. Shows his versatility that he can fill a lane on the break as well as bring it up. Morris, wow. Hands of Curry. Omar Habwe, and there's the lay-in by Jalen Gibbs, his first bucket of the night. Minnesota led by 16, 44-28 at the 15-30 mark. It's been a 17-7 run for the Mount since then, but just before the shot clock expires, the timeouts from Coach Patino in Minnesota, they balloon that back up to 13. Tough angle, shot goes in. Nice play there for D. Barnes. 13 points for Barnes, he's hit half his... 10 field goal attempts to them. Right side three, swish. Dupree McGuire, worn heavy, not only on Dupree, as you can expect in his family, but this program in general. It's been a really, really tough situation, but program stepped up. They launched a go fund me. There's a drive by Coffee. Offensive rebound and putback jam for Jordan Murphy. Almost got it to go. But here's Murphy with his first bucket and a no-doubter. Two free throws made by Coffey. 69-53, 16-point lead. And adding to that, a jam by McGrayer. Now the will drop to 3-10 and 10 and see their three-game winning streak come to an end. A 20-8 run for Minnesota to end this game. They win at 71-53.